Welcome to King's Crowd, a data company first and a VC firm second. There is a new opportunity in the private markets. There is actually a new market segment called the online private market. By that, we mean companies raising money on online capital marketplaces. They don't go to angel investors or VC firms. Instead, they list their companies on a marketplace where they create a raise page which is equivalent to the traditional pitch deck. Examples of such marketplaces are Republic, Start Engine, or WeFunder. That's one side of it. The other side of the online private market is online secondary trading. Shareholders of private companies can buy or sell shares in a completely online transaction. An example of such platforms is Forge or Equitybee. And recently, Start Engine and Republic also announced secondary markets for their own primary offerings. In 2020 alone, $30 billion worth of transactions took place in the online private markets. This number is expected to grow to $13 trillion in the next 10 years. Here are a few examples of companies that successfully raised capital online in their early stages. Look at their returns. The thing is, there are no funds currently serving LPs in this new market. It's usually individuals investing on their own. And most of the people I've talked to had never heard of these companies when they were raising capital, and they didn't know how or where to find them. The biggest question today is how to identify quality companies among the thousands of companies listed on more than 50 online marketplaces and how to build a diversified portfolio of these investments. That's why we're creating the first fund for the online private market. King's Crowd is a data company first and a VC firm second. For the past two and a half years, we've been collecting structured and unstructured data on thousands of startups from hundreds of sources, covering the full spectrum of this new market. This data is not like what's available on PitchBook or Crunchbase. It's far more detailed. It includes hundreds of data points on deal terms, valuations, target markets, differentiators, performance metrics, financials, founders, risk factors, and more. It also includes how much companies have raised, how long it took them to reach their funding goals, and how many people have invested. Since we've started, we've been rating companies, both qualitatively and quantitatively, and we've been tracking the performance of those companies to enhance our rating algorithm. We're now processing anywhere from 25 to 40 deals a week, and we're estimating that will increase to 100 deals a week in the next 18 to 24 months. Being able to access and conduct diligence on that type of deal flow at scale gives us an edge. To date, We've rated more than 2,200 online raises that have already raised more than $1.2 billion. And we know which ones did well and why based on the data we have. If you are wondering how our top-rated companies performed, here is the answer. We looked at all companies that raised online and we tracked their subsequent rounds. We then calculated the average unrealized return for all companies in this market, based on valuation growth between rounds. We then compared that average to the average unrealized return for companies that got high ratings from King's Crowd. Our return was 25% higher. We think that this difference can get much bigger over time, as more top-rated companies raise more subsequent rounds at higher valuations. Also, our highly rated companies have gone on to raise from such firms as Andreessen Horowitz and Lightspeed Ventures. This is not made with hindsight bias. This is based on actual historical ratings we've done over the past two and a half years. That's how we developed our investment thesis. Our fund is industry agnostic. It's quant first, that is, deal selection will be data driven. Then we'll apply a layer of human intervention last to conduct more research, talk to founders, and confirm selections. For this proof of concept fund, we're raising $10 million from up to 250 LPs who must be accredited investors. We're cutting traditional venture fees in half with 1% management fees 
and 10% performance fees, or carry. Our model, as a data company with already established revenue streams, enables us to offer such terms for a scalable and cost-effective, actively managed fund. Contrary to classical portfolio theory and proven by research done by the Kaufman Fellows Program, AngelList, and other institutions, for early stage venture returns, there is a direct correlation between portfolio size and overall fund return. We plan to depend first on our algorithms to source and vet new investment opportunities. Then our team will verify selections and make final investment decisions. We plan to invest 70% of the fund's capital in 100 companies with a standard check size of $50,000 in seed stage startups and $100,000 in early stage startups. 30% of the fund will be reserve capital used to double down on winners in subsequent rounds with a check size between $250,000 and $500,000. You will be among the pioneers investing in the first online quant VC firm that is more scalable, cost-effective, and time efficient, which will give you a one-click diversification for a new differentiated return stream and you'll get access to portfolio details and updates via our King's Crowd portfolio software. In the appendix slides, you can find more details about King's Crowd products, the vision for future funds, and the team, with special highlights on the investment team members. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please reach out to capital at kingscrowd.com.